Greetings. Salutations. Yes, I am still alive. I apologize for the very long wait between the last video, which was the essential phone. <sighs> I have not had a good run. Uh, mostly due to a very bad back issue. Um, it was If you followed me on Facebook or social media, you would have noticed that I had commented on it. And um, I went and got some x-rays. Haven't heard a thing from my doctor. Of course not. Um, it's better now because I started taking this new supplement. Uh, a friend from mine, uh, Jim in Scotland, um, mentioned about taking it. It's made a big difference in the back issue. Uh, I still have a bad back, but the uh, the pain level has dropped significantly, which is good because it was really bad. I went the day I went to get the X-rays. Um, I was probably about an eight and a half, almost a nine out of ten by the time I got home. I wasn't really sure. I would be able to get home, um, but I did. But uh, I started taking the supplements the same day, thereabouts. And it took about a week for them to really kick in there. But by the time that they did, it was was, was really good. Um, so, needless to say, um, leading up to that, I was really not feeling very well. And I was having a lot of problems. I ended up picking up a new cane um, so I could have a cane because I had trouble just standing up. Just getting up was, was the problem. Moving wasn't so bad, but it was the getting up from a sitting position and stuff. It was really, it was quite, quite painful. And I'm hoping that I will eventually hear something from my doctor about the x-rays. Uh, my doctor is very slow at getting back to me about doing things. It is what it is. I'm not going to worry about it, but I'm feeling a little bit better now. But I don't have any tech items coming. Um, I do have a new watch coming, though. And I may do a review over that. It's a, it's a health watch. But it is way more than just like a Fitbit or something like that. This thing does quite a lot. So I think it will be worthy of doing a review over. Of course, it's coming from China, so it's going to take another two to four weeks to get here. But um, I figure it's time to put up a video... I've been meaning to do a video, but I haven't really been feeling too great the last couple of days. I think I'm kind of like fighting a flu or something. So, I haven't really had much to say. I haven't been super perky. Um, and I don't like to make videos when I don't feel good or something because, you know, there's a lot of negative stuff out there on the internet. And I, I don't really want to add to that. So, I thought it'd be best to wait till I was feeling a little bit better. Which I am. By the way, in case you wanted, yes... I still have the essential phone, and it just got the October 5th security patch update. My Google Pixel, which is the original, well, I can show it to you, the original Pixel XL, it has not gotten the security patch for October. So, uh, once again, proving the essential phone is definitely worth buying at the price that you can get it now. It still gets updates, it still does everything good, and um, I saw that there might be a chance for the Essential Phone 2, which is going to be a total different look with a whole different UI. So, I'm sure it'll be priced relatively high when it comes out. I mean, I, if it was less than 500 I'd be stunned. It's probably going to be much closer to the 700 to 800 lead. But another year or two, when the price comes down, like it did on this Essential Phone, I'll probably get one. But uh, it's a really nice design. If you get a chance, just type in Essential Phone 2 and look for the one that's thin. It's only about this this wide, but it's really tall. It, it's, it's, a, it's a kind of a weird look. But I think it'll be a, a pretty an interesting one to look at. And of course, there's a lot of good tech coming out at the end of the year. This is when there's a lot of good tech. I unfortunately just don't have the money to buy a lot of it. Um, I spent my money on the watch because I needed a good watch that was tracking a lot of things like your heart and all this stuff. And the new watch does a lot more than that. So I'm going to save that for a different video because there really is a lot to go into with that one. The last one I had was pretty good, but the strap broke on it and... The replacement strap was almost as much as the watch was brand new, and it didn't quite do as much as I wanted. I wanted a really good one. I mean, the Fitbit styles are nice, but I wanted something that did a lot more health-wise and kept better track of things, and uh, this one's going to be good. So That's what's coming up eventually. Um, I may do a video of some sort before that, because like I said, it's probably going to be another month before it gets here. But when I wanted to post this video. I had a couple people ask how I was doing, why I hadn't posted anything, and now you know I was just in a lot of pain. And it was hard for me to even sit here in this chair on some days. I would have to stretch out on the bed and 
stretching out. I couldn't even get comfortable in that because it was just it was it was a lot of pain. So um, for the supplement I'm taking there, I might do a video about that. Um, kind of give you a heads up about that. Like I said, it's it's been a couple of weeks, so I'm going to take it for a little bit longer before I definitely say I think it made a difference. But for now, I really think it made a difference. Uh, but I'll give it a little bit longer, and, and then I might do a video about that one for anybody else who has some some severe pain, uh, anything that's inflammatory, you know, like joints and stuff like that. That's what this stuff works for. So I, I'll probably do a video about that in the future as well. All right, I hope you're all doing well. I hope you're uh, getting through the day and things are going your way. All right. Catch you all on the next one.